So we start the recording, open Undertale. This is the one that's going to be going on the channel, by the way, so I'll full screen it. Welcome to Undertale, y'all. Part one. Hello. My mom's here. <laughs> so I think if we can, we're going to be doing a sort of segmented Undertale run with a different episode at every core area of the game. Like, beat a boss, um, and stop the recording. Beat a boss, save, stop the recording. I do like the artwork. Yeah, it's good. Oh, I think somebody's tripped. Yep, that was probably a bad joke to be made there. Sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> uh, or falling out of bed. <laughs> good stuff. I'm really hoping this recording comes out good. The test did. Dramatic sting. Starting. Boop. <laughs> Simple controls and rules here, really. I get my hands in the right spot. Hmm. The fallen human. Tripster. <laughs> I'm gonna see if that actually fits. the smartest of boys. Nope, not enough space for trips to... Okay, just trips. But we're allowed six characters, so... This work? Sure. Yes. Cool. Trips. Is it? Trips. Can't fit that, unfortunately. Right. We good, though? Yes. Because cool. he did trip and fall. Yes. He was falling a few... He tripped, and then he became a fallen human. And now we're here. My god, what happened to our face? <laughs> How are we so jaundiced? We've become the flower. My god. Okay, so, walking off to the right, and... My god, it's a door! What shall I do? Go Confusion. Through. Oh god. Well, for a flower, that sure is jumpy. Do you trust this guy? I don't know. <laughs> Should we? Sure. Nice eyes. Should we take it? Yes. You didn't even have to move around. Huh? Well, hello. You bastard! Twist. But didn't we get twenty health point from that? Or was that 
He hit us once, which knocked us from 20 to 1. Oh, I gotcha. And then we got magically healed to 20. You could say this is a tutorial. So I feel like we should go over our plans for what we're actually going to do this run. Okay. I believe we agreed that we would... Oh, just a wonderfully drawn save point, by the way. Nice two-frame gif. Oh, was that the save point, Little Star? Yeah. Well, save. And to save, you just go click Z. Z. Z on a save point. Thank you. E. So, if memory serves, we were going to do a pacifist run until we got utterly bored, right? Which probably won't take long. Yeah. From the way you described it to me. Yeah, late in the game, the enemies just get really boring to fight, especially when they come in packs. why not push every button. Thanks, sign that I read by pressing Z. So we act. So practice talk. Yep. We can, so we can either check its stats or talk to it. Well, we'll go with talk. So what? Torius? Torial. Torial. We've got four buttons here. Fight, act, item, and mercy. Well, if we were doing a passive, what does that mean? Generally, we act, select the enemy, and we've got three different options. Check stats and a variable number of other things based on the enemy. So this dude, we can either check his stats, threaten him, or compliment him. Hmm. Checking his stats provides his stats plus a little flavor text. Okay, well, let's check his stats. Get some info on him. Now it's his. Oh. Okay. Bye, Froggy. <laughs> you want nothing. <laughs> I mean, we didn't defeat him. Huh? The Western Room is the Eastern Room's blueprint. Because this is the western room. 
You can see there's a marked path here. Oh, yeah. Therefore, come on, let me pass. Oh, come on. Mommy. <laughs> yep. Following the path exactly. I didn't even have control for that. Autopilot? Mm hmm. Conspicuous pillar. Gotcha. Are we three? Are we even human? Well, we have no experience. We're still, like... We're still level one. We don't know anything, but here's a phone. So we have an empty bag, our stats screen, and a cell phone. With a stick and a bandage. <laughs> that stick is important. Is it? Yes, that stick's actually important. I think I think the bandage is too. So keep them. Yep, got it. So sh what should we do, Mom? Well, she said to stay here. Yep. Huh. Well then, can you access the pillar again? Nope. Can you do anything with the vines? Doesn't seem so. cell phone now. We could... Yes, yes. Because there doesn't seem to be anything else in the room with us. Correct. Even by backtracking. Yeah. Oh! What was that? You saw it too? I saw something yellow blink. So did I. You've done that before, haven't you? What? The path walk. I think so, yeah. So what was that yellow blink? Let's chase it and find out. Oh, we have to chase it? I don't know. I've never actually done this before. I've oh. I've always taken the stupid indirect routes. Well. Review the footage later. Okay. Because that's kind of spooky. I guess use the cell phone? But they're op all options have been used, right? Say hello. could just keep going anyways. Okay. 
Can I read that sign? Nope, I cannot. Just triggers an aerial warp. I am concerned about what that yellow was. Yes, because it was definitely there. This footage is getting reviewed. I swear to God, if OBS has an encoding error for this, I'm going to have some kind of an aneurysm. Yeah. Okay. It only works that one specific route. Wouldn't it be a kick in the head if somehow my voice is the one having audio issues now? I would not like that. Oh, hey, hello. Yeah, I moved into the area we weren't supposed to go into previously. Right after I leave the room. Save anyway? Well, yeah. Determination. What's this guy's story? Oh, it's a fight. Well, when he checked him, he left. What happens if you compliment? I think the reason that he left was because Toriel was there, and she's not now. Life is difficult for this enemy, so what should we do? Because I know what we're supposed to do, but I want to see what you have to say. Well, since I've never played this, I just... Uh, let's compliment him, see if he sticks his tongue out. Now we have to dodge an attack. So we roll over Mercy, and that yellow means he's sparable. You don't gain any XP from sparing anything. Okay. Done. So is that part of the passive thing? Yep. Okay. So that's the route we're working on? Yep. Which is what we did. Yes. Save again, because we did a thing. And we got some advice. Yes. <laughs> what is this? Take one. Yes. Leaves? Leaves? Oh, pringle, pringle. oh my god, another one. Shall we repeat? Yes. We know he doesn't want to fight. Yep, so we compliment him, which makes him I'm flattered, so he doesn't want to fight anymore. Ready to show mercy. Boom. That was a bit of advice, so that's what we did. Yep. Now, Grant, you don't always have to follow the advice, though, do you? What do you mean? Well, I mean, you could have killed him. Yeah. But not in the mode we're playing. Yeah. Okay. I could have chosen to kill him, but this is a run where we're trying to avoid doing that because if you do nothing but kill, you get crappy endings. That's right. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, oh Vunderbar. So now you have to decide which door takes you back where you came from? Oh. That one. That'll work. Well, I like them both, but I'll say butterscotch. Or what? Because you can eat more butterscotch than you can eat cinnamon. Ugh! It took five steps, come on. Four gray rocks recommend you push them. Oh, it's this guy again. I don't even need to. I don't even need to go over these encounters anymore. I just need to 
dodge the singular attack they have. Sparing them is a lot easier than fighting early on. Emphasis early on. Oh, there's a path we have to walk. Lovely. Take care of the one. Well, we know what frog it'll do. Do you clear them both one at one at a time? Yeah, that's the thing that you get into later on. You need to figure out if you should and spare them one by one, or do something cool and spare them all at once, which takes longer and is more effort. Well, since we know frog, it let's check out Wimson. All right. Check. Check. Yes. Please. Neither one of them like to fight. Okay. Whimson actually doesn't even damage you unless you m make. <laughs> okay. Okay. You wanna console him? It's yeah. Okay, Froggy. We're, we're talking to Whimson. Oh, I thought it was. There are two enemies here. Okay, one's compliment, one's console. So, okay, console. Every enemy actually gets unique text. Uh, I'm an oh. idiot. Every enemy actually gets unique text over their name in the end credits based on, on whether, based on how exactly you spared them. <laughs> you stepped on the leaves. No. Ah! So close. It's these idiots. It's this idiot again. Okay, let's try the other act. That's not the passive one, is it? Yeah, as long as we don't fight it, it still counts as passivism. Oh, okay. Boogie boogie. Booga booga nooga. Oh, he can't handle this. Didn't even have to move to dodge that. Mercy. Well, I know how to. I know the proper way to do this. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you need to terrorize and then- Oh, never mind. You don't terrorize and console it. Even I'm forgetting what you're supposed to do in this godforsaken game. with that second pair of eyes under it. Maybe that's his chest breathing. Maybe, yeah. Still looks weird. Yes, it does. And Toby close to the rest of him, that looked completely normal. And Toby Fox runs on weird. Even back when he was working on Homestuck, he was insane. But we're here now. Jo Mold, Mold small. small. Yep. It looks like Christmas jello. I'm always up for check first. Just to see what they got. Is it yellow? <laughs> <laughs> and then the worst attack. All of these beginning enemies are totally worthless. Okay, how do we act? Flirt! Woohoo! <laughs> what else are you with something that's got no brains and curvy? 
Yep. How about we just do everything? Okay. Imitate. <laughs> Scorch. Well, we acted every way possible, so I guess we'll spare this turn. Yes. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. I'm uncomfortable. Well, you flirted and wiggled with Jello. The Jello was at least dumb enough that I could be aware it was just a joke, you know? <laughs> you suck. <laughs> That's how my teachers act. Say boy. It squeaks when you use it. So obviously the cheese has something to do with her. Oh, probably. Oh. So we can't take it, okay. It looks like it's a ghost. It's only pacifist if it's only it only stops being pacifist if we kill something. All right, sorry, we're gonna have to poke the ghost. Nab, stab, look. Check. And then it cries on us. Okay, oh, that's a right. potent attack! Okay, suddenly it's threatening. We went from zero to- We went from first to a third real quick on that one. I think if you threaten it, we'd attack you again. Yeah, probably. How about we flirt? Because it doesn't have a sense of humor, so fear is probably not gonna work. That didn't even damage me. It's not yellow, so it won't work. Cheer? That looked like a step in the right direction. Not. They look a little bit better. Keep doing it. Yeah. So the cheer. Yeah. Got two laughs out of him. Got two chuckles. This attack is pain! Just leaves. Aww. So not everything's gonna give you gold or XP. Yeah. Just access to another area. You've told me about the spider bake sale. Uh huh. We need to buy something here. Yes. What's the second web? Okay, just a second place to buy stuff, I guess. All right. You need to buy something in there for there late in the game. There is something that you need. Yes. I can't remember what it was. I do. I know you do. Oh! 
I don't think I should be carrying it anymore. Frog. <laughs> I hear he has separate dialogue for if you skip through, but I can't be bothered to find out. Function number four. What was a yellow name? What? A yellow name when you can spare it. Also an Easter egg here. That's not the Easter egg. That's I don't know what that is. Guy. Looks. You could say he looks at you. Well, let's check him out. Take a look at Luke's. Luke's Eyewalker. Don't pick on him. Luke's Eyewalker, Mom. Oh, I I hate this game. So it says don't pick on. Don't pick on. He's like the only enemy so far. Okay, he's sparable now. So the Easter egg, as you were saying, an ant-sized frog. There's not even a visible crack in the wall right there. Hey, hey, ref I got first try. And there's something conspicuous in the left side room. Something new. We know mold spell. Mold small. But we don't know. Let's check. Obey the overmind! Well, that was pathetic. You just make a really pathetic team, you two. Okay, I'm gonna spare molds, molds mold this turn to free up some space. Oh, now it's sparable. Okay. okay, so you need to spare everything else before you can spare it. Okay. Oh, like anything you've already met before? Well, we spared the mold small and the it calmed down. Okay. Or I'm gonna talk to it now just to trigger just to see if that triggers something. Okay. Well, nothing happened, so spare. Well that makes sense. The things that we know can be spared. Now what's over there? Looks like a twin dip. How about we find out? Oh, it's a dude! Veggie toy. serving size mean? Is that something you can eat? Well, like, like cereal serving size is one bowl, generally. Okay. But is it something that you can eat? It generally refers to food, yeah. Okay. So it refers to how much, it refers to how much of the food you'd need to eat to consume whatever's listed in the nutrition facts. Like the serving size of soda is one can. Okay. But in this game, is this something well, there's a devour option there, but that's that, uh, that would probably kill it, so... It so says... It oh, that was cheap. That was cheap, too. Almost killed you. Okay, what's dinner, then? Oh, 
Now, green projectiles heal you for one HP. Oh, sparable. So green is good. Yep, green project. Green projectiles heal you. Light blue attacks only hurt you if you're moving. Dinner. Get some green. Yeah. And dinner is what triggers it to be sparable too. Okay, this is this is chaos. Okay, I'm I'm That's dying. Not work. Oh, it's spared, but um. Oh, but I look at you. Yeah. <laughs> that green was not worth what happened to you. It you really lost more than you got. Okay. Yes. Yeah, just push every switch. That's what you're meant to do. Something's gonna happen. Like it, like most games, loot everything. Oh God. Have enough health to do anything, do it. Yeah, I just fled. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I, I, I just left, man. No. So we get something to give us some health. Cease. I'm out of here. There's the blue switch. Oh, the red switch now. Yep. It's rotations in perspective, you see that? Yes. Just flip the clock. Can you not? Oh god, I pushed the wrong button. We're gonna die. And then it's game over. Okay, somehow I lived. I'm not even sure how to survive that turn. Third decided to pick on you? Mm-hmm, that's what it said. What? What? Oh, the green support at the bottom. Oh. Different perspectives. And your health does not regen over time. You have to actually eat something to regain your you health. You have to either eat or get to a save point. Oh. Yeah. And I don't want to backtrack to the last save point no. because that was a while ago. Yes, it was. So, you're just trying to find a save point. <laughs> uh, T-Junction. Fantastic. That looks like something not the important so I'm going to. What's this guy's story? A knife! Knife! Ripper! And this was the joke that no one got. That's a different game. Yep. Okay, so what do you do with the toy knife? It's a weapon. It still does more damage than stick. Okay. We won't actually be using it, of course. I'm just gonna stash it in a box when I find one. <laughs> Twit. <laughs> what an amazing face. Yes, mother. Naturally, because we're playing a video game, go everywhere except where we're supposed to. Do that last. Exactly. Advance the plot last. 
left. There was nothing. There was something to the left, but. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Fine, goat mom. Meh. I mean, she is a goat. Let's go the other way. Ah, oh, nice fire. Not a hot fire? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anything to do with the table? Or you just check it everything? Check everything. Three chairs. And yet you can't take it or do anything with it. Nope. What kind of a mother is she if there's nothing to snack on? Yeah. Creepy? Or is it? So, that wasn't your room, was it? I thought it was the first door. I'm just checking everything. Okay. Oh. But of course. No. Okay. Am I going to have to explain to you what tsundere means in front of an audience? Uh, no. <laughs> Good! I'll look it up myself. It's a lot less terrible than I make it sound. Music just shifts entirely depending on lamp. There's nothing. So does that go to? Is that the pie that will go in your inventory? How about we check inventory? Because you've got a knife, right? Check the stats on your stuff. It's distinctly not licorice. I have no idea what it is, but it is absolutely not licorice. Now, is this the item that you'll need later? This is, yes. This powder donut, you will need it. Do not eat it. Correct. You can get another one, but you need to have at least one. Ah, uh, the rare plastic butter knife. Always got it. Restores all. That's also like that's also very useful. I'd save that for like the very end. It's actually useful for a specific fight. Okay. So is that the only butterscotch pie you'll ever get? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna, probably gonna put it in a box. Oh, to save until you need it. Yeah. 
so I don't consume it by accident because true, true. inventory space is finite. The donut as well. The donut I can at least get a second one of. But you'd have to go back to where you got it. Yeah. That'd be a lot of backtracking. Yeah. Ignore the crunching of me opening a Tootsie Roll in the background. Because Halloween candy. Mm-hmm. That face is just so uncanny. So when you sleep, does it restore your health? Not sure. Had full health before I slept. What should we say? We can go home. This this is your home. I knew she'd say that. <laughs> sure. Do snails come in handy in the game? Should we talk again? <laughs> but there's a spice machine now. Yep. Should we talk to her again? How to exit the ruins? Mm -hmm. How to exit? Well, she ran away fast. And I know where. But how would you know if you've never played this before? You only have like two places to go anyways. Out or down? Yeah. Trial and error. Well. No. Run. Run as fast as you can. Run like the wind. Run, 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 as Sinistar would say. Keep running, boys. Keep running. Because that's the way out. You said you are going to put things in a box. Yeah, those are later in the game. Okay. We have to fight Torium. Well, she said fight. Oh, how about we don't fight and s how about we I just her out of it. Oh. oh I got hit for four damage I know how to spare her okay. should I just do it yeah. you need to do it like eight times what you need to spare her a crap ton of times. Very good music. Toby Fox's previous composer work really shines. Now you can do her. You just Oops. do it. Eventually she accepts, basically. But they're almost dead. Or run away, she, says. she says. 
Okay, now she's doing an attack that doesn't even hit me unless I go into it. Hmm. A lot less than I expected from that whole attack 80 thing. Oh, you see your face! You can see the, those eyes. Because I'm low on HP, she won't kill me. She actively avoids hitting you if you're low on health. So eventually Mercy will work? Yep. We hope. Yeah, I've run this before. You haven't. All your attacks are magical, you old goat. Lord, woman. What's with the fonting? It looks really nasty. You can see the R is the R is terrible. It's like a bad version of courier type. Yeah, probably is. Might have something to do with the fact that we're running this in full screen. But this piece of crap wouldn't record in windowed. At all. Yeah, we spent about ten minutes trying to figure that out, didn't we? Yeah. Can I have you do something before you go through that door? Hmm. Go back to the bed and sleep if you can see if your health comes back. If I can. You know what I mean? Yeah, you may not be able to go back to the bed now at this point. Let's see if we'll let you. Well, I'm pushing down. So it's not letting you go back now. Oh. There we go. But it'd be interesting to see if the bed restores health. Yeah. A conspicuous lack of music. That stair is, like, really badly staggered. No, don't hit that. Is that new to you? It occurs if you sleep repeatedly, and yes, it did fully restore our HP. Nice. Yes. Well, there's a safe box right outside her door, is that correct? Oh, uh, yeah, let's do that. Safe don't want to die and have to fight her again, do you? No, I don't. It kind of sucked, honestly. It was just right. sparing over and over and dodging. Really spiked attacks, you know? Like a, a big spike in difficulty compared to the previous foes. So the bed is health restore. That's good. That's well, very good to know. It's one way. Not that you really would ever want to backtrack all the way back to the bed. We can't. Oh, once you leave, you can't go back? She said it was one way, Mom. Okay, well, at least we've saved and we're full of health. So you said if you can't ever go back, and if you, for some reason, ended up using that spider donut, how would you get another spider donut? I was an idiot who forgot that you couldn't go back. Um. Either way, I didn't use it anyway. Oh, it's this kid again. Well, you saved before you left. You could reload the save. Yes, I 
I could. Apologies to all our viewers because I just brushed my hand against the mic and that probably popped. Is that supposed to be creepy? I don't know. How much further, we, what was the goal to go until we did what? Basically every segment of the game. So we hit the next save and quit the recording. So we just cleared a segment. Yep, we beat Toriel. We get the dramatic sting, a new area. I'm hoping to save every area transition. Well, so this would be our next, this would be it then? Yep. So we wait for a safe spot because. Oh yeah, the door's totally one way. So the only way you can get back there now is just to reload the save you just made. Yes. So don't eat the spider, don't. Yeah. Stick, Stick in the road. <gasps> oh. I heard something. And the stick broke. Are you being followed? You saw that. I had a whip cushion. Hardy har har. My god, that font's awful. Look at the kerning. Yes, I see that. The A and W are the same letter. Yep. That's what he said. Hmm. Lazy bones. He's offering it up. <laughs> Hiding in plain sight. Oh god. You never you never thought that. Mom. A skelly con. Of work.
was terrible. Yeah, screw you too, buddy. Of course! I'll be up ahead, he says, he and walks back. the opposite direction. And save, or... Yep. Now there's really no going back. And we're done. 